you've probably noticed your second graders' word problems have become a little more complicated. But they can handle it. As second graders master the skills of solving addition and subtraction problems within 100, they also learn to apply these skills to word problems. Byron Slinger has 47 Digimon. How many Digimon does Marcus have? Figuring out on their own whether to use addition or subtraction is half the challenge. But once they get this far, they're well on their way to finding the correct answer. Plus 24 equals 71. You'll probably see them working on different types of word problems. How many pieces of sushi were there before? The important thing is that they can set up the problem on their own and can solve it correctly. Blank minus 14 equals 56, so it must be a really big number. 69, 60, 69, 70. How do you know your child can apply math? By the end of the year, second graders know whether to use addition or subtraction in a word problem without help and can solve problems with answers up to 100.